Hey, what's going on guys? You boys, probably 2K7 and we are back with a brand new American Truck Simulator featuring our towing company, Ace Towing and Recovery. As you guys know, we have been running our towing company mostly or exclusively in Grand Theft Auto 5. Well, today, as you can see, I'm here to announce that we now have our tow company operating in American Truck Simulator, which is pretty cool. So if you guys look right over the door, you can see our company. We are based in Los Angeles, California. So that's going to be where most of our towing, uh, I guess most of our jobs are going to be. But, you know, ATS doesn't always cooperate and it kind of sends us all over the place. So right now we are in Carlsbad and we're going to be picking up a Volvo and taking it to Barstow. Now, let me know what you guys think about our Peterbilt heavy duty wrecker here. I'm going to go ahead and turn the lights on so you guys can see it beautiful truck i kind of went overboard with the uh beacons on the front i started off with just the beacons on the bumper then i added two to the grill and the next thing you know i have like this giant x x shape on my grill but it looks pretty cool let me know what you guys think about that too it's kind of synced like with the side view mirrors and across the grill and the bumper i figured we'll do like that x pattern i don't know i thought it i thought it looked nice but anyway guys uh let's go ahead and get started it's about five o'clock in the morning or so and we are here at uh i don't even know what this place is but we're here and we gotta go pick up that volvo over there so let's throw this into the air and let's get going all right so we're gonna be picking up that volvo that broke down we're also gonna be uh hauling it with the trailer too so it's a fully loaded trailer should be nice and interesting for our first official load here. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and back the wrecker right on up. Somebody's gonna be like, hey, so you're supposed to hit your horn three times when you're backing up. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and attach to this Volvo. Now, the cool thing, once we're ready to attach, the uh, tow bar would automatically go down the underreach, which is nice. Pretty close at this point. Yep, there we go. Go ahead and put that into neutral, set our parking brake. Let's go ahead and hop outside so we can see what we are doing. So the way that the loads come up, they basically just show up as like these um, trucks on jack stands. So sometimes it will be like a truck and trailer. Sometimes it will just be the truck alone. So it's pretty cool. And we're going to go ahead and attach. You guys are going to see the underreach go down, and we now have it locked and loaded. If only it was that easy in real life, huh? <laughs> All right, guys, so we are ready to roll. We have 165 miles. We're going to be taking this thing. So let's put it in gear. Let's start pulling out here. We have a 550 horsepower engine in our truck, so nothing that we cannot handle. I wonder how traffic's going to be out here, too. I also wonder once we get to the location, does it expect me to back this thing up? Because I was messing around with it earlier, Turn and left. backing this up was super hard. So I guess we're going to have to find out once we get there. Alright, left is clear, right is clear. Let's go ahead and start coming out.
get ready to turn right. Alright, right and a left, and then we'll jump on the highway. Turn right. Damn. You know what? Let me slow down. What am I doing coming in this fast? Right, I kind of messed up this turn here, but let's see if I can save it. I'm heading a curve there. Let me just see how much. Ah, oh, we're okay. See, so yeah, that's that's the tricky part. Really having to swing this thing wide. Stay left. Uh -oh. Ooh, gotta get over. Track arrow is bugging out a bit there. Alright, so speed limit here is 65. I'm taking it a little bit easy though because we are towing another vehicle, so. We're going about 52. I'm going to slowly try to get it up to speed, though. Stay right, and then exit right. All right, we're going to be getting off, looks like, onto the 40 here. Exit right. Stay left. I think I read that sign wrong because this is a 40 not to 10. Uh oh.
stay right and then exit right. Exit right. Oh, that truck got pulled over. You guys saw that? Did I say that? Was that a truck slow lane? Or I should stay over there. That's how it's really slowing me down. Look at the scenery, hold up. Beautiful area. These hills here are no joke. Stay left. Stay left. Alright guys, we're almost at our destination. I could just about see it on the map. Stay right, and then exit right. Exit right. Turn 
turn right. Ready to turn left. Yeah, turn looks left. like we're dropping off at the not sure if that's a cat dealership or jump site. Turn left. Turn left. <laughs> they already have another broken down Volvo here too. Well, now they got two. Dang, I really wonder if they want me to we back are this thing up. I, I know for a fact I cannot back this thing up properly. Alright, let's see what they want us to do. Alright, we don't have to do the hard one at least, but we could try... Oh, they just want us to pull for it. Okay. Alright, nice and easy. Not an issue. So we are done, guys. All we gotta do is drop this thing right here. Go ahead and get out of here. We're going to put it into neutral, set our parking brake, uh, we'll turn off our, oh, we didn't really turn it off in real life, but we'll go ahead and get this connected. And we are done, guys. So we delivered the broken Volvo from Carlsbad to Barstow. We got an excellent, we made $16,000. So the money that you make is a little bit unrealistic. I don't think we would have made that much for that simple tow. But um, definitely, I'll take it, though. I will take it. So let me know what you guys thought about this episode and what you guys think about our new wrecker. We're going to be doing other uh, loads as well. Oh, excuse me. Let me kind of show you what else we have that we can do. So we did the Volvo. Let's see what else is out there. So we can pick up a broken W900. There's also a broken Peterbilt 389, and there's a broken T680 that also has a trailer. So those are the three types of loads, and then it basically just repeats in different locations. So we'll try out different ones. But um, yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. I really do hope you guys enjoyed this one. So many people have been asking me to do some more towing. So I really do hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure you guys go ahead and smash that like button. Leave some comments down below. Subscribe if you are new. Also hit that notification bell so you'll be notified whenever we post a new video. But that's going to do it for this one, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.